Hello YouTube, my name is Froyolan and welcome to another episode of Lifestyle and Sneakers. Today we're going to take a look at another basketball shoe. This time it's the Nike Paul George 3 in the NASA colorway. So stick around. Before we continue with the video, let me remind you that our Epic Air Jordan giveaway is still ongoing. We're giving away 6 Air Jordan sneakers to 6 lucky subscribers. Uh, please the, the, check the mechanics down below. And also, we all already reached our first, second, and third milestone. And we already the, announced the first winner uh, last Sunday. And we'll be announcing the second winner this coming Sunday as well. The PG3 is the latest model from uh, Paul George's uh, signature line for Nike. And the NASA colorway was the first colorway to release. And uh, the inspiration for this shoe is uh, Paul George's fascination with NASA since he was young. Uh, in Palmdale, California, where he grew up, there's a big NASA facility that he always see and uh, always fascinated by it. Uh, this shoe was released last uh, January 26 of this year. Uh, we had our pair. We have our pair for a while now, and we haven't had the chance to uh, open it up for you guys. So here you go. Let's open the box. Now let's look at the details. Let's start with the upper. First thing you'll notice, the upper has this uh, bright orange color and it's made out of uh, this nylon mesh material. Uh, the mesh is uh, woven like tightly so it's, it, you cannot see through them. Uh, anyway, there is a leather overlay here uh, on the toe area to protect your toe. Then on the forefoot area, uh, on the previous model, there's a strap across the forefoot area. This time, it's uh, they call it uh, wings. It's uh, on both the lateral and medial side. So, on the medial side, it's uh, color red. On the lateral side, it's blue. And it's a very stiff ma material that holds your uh, forefoot in place. So, your, your foot won't slip off of the shoe. And uh, the tongue is made out of neoprene and uh, on top of that, there's a silver uh, material here and there's a, a black uh, nylon uh, uh, strap here uh, uh, that acts as a, a lace uh, holder. On the ankle area, there's the same uh, silver uh, metallic uh, synthetic material here uh, it looks like the space blanket or the lining under the astronauts uh, uniform to keep them warm so this is uh, the spacesuit inspiration also the the inside is uh, they have a silver uh, fabric and the ankle area is uh, uh, padded really well so it won't uh, secure your ankle in this area and you have uh, a very stiff stiff heel count uh, heel cup and there so now the details so on this uh, on the left shoe there's the PG uh, logo on the right shoe there's a American flag on the tongue on the left shoe there's the NASA patch and on the right shoe there's the Apollo 13 uh, patch at the, at the back, then the pole George uh, here on the, the pull tab. So that's it for the upper. Now let's look at the midsole. The midsole is made out of uh, this new uh, EVA foam. Nike claimed it's a uh, uh, little softer and lighter than the pre previous version. Anyway, the color is silver all throughout, except for this part. The, this part here, uh, it's not 
made out of the same EVA foam. This one is very stiff actually. And there's uh, Palmdale's, uh, Palmdale California zip code. Uh, Nike swoosh on uh, the lateral side. And then the heel part, there's a text. Uh, let me read it. It says here, don't tell me the sky's the limit when there are footprints on the moon. So that is a very uh, a good quote uh, from, I think, Paul George. Uh, anyway, it also has a, uh, uh, air, a zoom airbag unit here on the forefoot area. So uh, it absorbs impact on that area. I'm not sure if, I think they don't have it here on the, the heel area. So anyway, the outsole is made out of this uh, black rubber. Now the traction pattern uh, is unique. It's uh, circular. Uh, they, uh, Nike said that it's uh, inspired by uh, the moon's uh, craters and the design here is actually uh, uh, the traction design is actually uh, based on Paul George's uh, uh, movement on the court anyway here's uh, Paul George's signature here and the zoom uh, airbag so on the left shoe it's uh, uh, red on the right shoe, it's blue. So that's it for the shoe. Overall, the new uh, the new PG3 is a very good uh, performance basketball sneaker. Uh, it has a very good upper uh, material, uh, very stiff, very stable. Uh, you have your four foot lock down here, the heel lock down here. Uh, you have a very good outsole that's a very grippy and very durable for your uh, indoor and outdoor use. And uh, the Paul George uh, Light actually don't deviate too much from the previous models. Uh, it actually almost uh, still have the same shape or silhouette as the original one, uh, the PG1 almost the same they don't deviate too much they will have uh, improvements here and there changes here and there but the actual uh, shape uh, they doesn't they don't change it too much and uh, this colorway is actually uh, I don't uh, like it that much but uh, there's a new uh, uh, PG3 NASA colorway coming uh, coming uh, soon it's called the uh, Apollo missions that one is uh, more of my taste and but this is a very good uh, any color you get this is gonna be uh, a very good performance basketball sneaker and at uh, 120 US dollars uh, this is gonna be the most affordable bang for your buck, uh, buck uh, basketball sneaker one of the best uh, sneaker you can get for that price before we end this video may I just remind you again that our epic Air Jordan giveaway is still ongoing we're uh, giving away six Air Jordan sneakers to six lucky subscribers uh, actually we reach our first second and third milestones already and we already announced the winner for the first uh, Air Jordan uh, we'll be announcing the second one this coming weekend and uh, please check the mechanics uh, in the description box and we'll be flashing it in a bit. I would also like to take this opportunity to say, say uh, thank you to all our subscribers. Uh, thank you for uh, supporting us and believing in us. Uh, we promise to give you more uh, quality content in the future. I would also like to uh, thank uh, Mr. Carlo Ople for helping us promote uh, our channel in his uh, YouTube channel. Thank you very much, sir. I hope you like this video. And if you do, please press the thumbs up button down below. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please press the subscribe button. Also, uh, please like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram. Again, my name is Froyland. Until next time.